and then tell them about the minister. In this house, there are great spiritual teachers, but most of the preachers don't talk about the war of Armageddon. And by the grace of God, when we finish today, I hope that we will be full gospel teachers. You know, you know, when 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 you're afraid of certain passages in the book that we didn't write, your voice gets stuck like a frog is in your throat because fear stops you. And I pray that Allah will bless me today to take the fear out of every gospel preacher. Take the fear out of all those who want truth to be told but you have to have the faith and the courage to speak the truth truth is the most necessary ingredient for our salvation In St. John 8 and 32, I think it is, Jesus said, we shall know the truth and that truth will set us free. And the members of the Jewish community who were listening said, how do you say, we shall be set free? We've never been in bondage to any man. Well, you need to be set free from the bondage of sin that has gripped the children of Abraham, Muslims, Christians, Jews, and all the human family of our planet. You'll never be a happy people if you're afraid to speak the truth. You'll never be free until you recognize you're a slave, sometimes to your own wickedness. And the truth will absolutely set us free. So we're going to have a, a rough ride today but you look to me like the rough riders why must there be a war to end all wars. We have to have this war because Satan was given 6,000 years 
to do his work. And he's done it so well, pastors. He's done it so well that the scripture says, Satan deceived the whole world. Now that's a big deception, isn't it? You say, well, wait a minute. Am I one of those deceived? Who wants to admit that you've been lied to and you believe the lie? And so you're a deceived human being. See, and when somebody has lied so well that the whole world has been gripped by his lies. So when truth comes and a man born to tell that truth, no wonder the deceiver has to hide that man. I've never been an anti-Semite. And uh, if I had them in front of me, they could not prove their charge. But they make the charge. And when they make the charge, they have control of so much that shapes thinking and the human mind. That whatever they say, they keep saying. And so when Farcon comes, boy, I'm glad you all came out today. because they don't want you to hear what I'm about to say. 